Hi, and welcome to the first in a series of videos designed to introduce you to the BMC MyIT Service Broker solution. This specific demonstration is a general overview of Service Broker. We'll have follow-on demonstrations that'll take a closer look at some of the capabilities you're about to see. But first, a brief solution introduction. MyIT Service Broker is a new service app store built for the digital workplace that lets you or a third party onboard, manage, deliver, and analyze IT and business services from multiple sources, both external and internal. This is done by creating, publishing, and managing a service, which is a fairly simple process that spans a set of personas that are built into the solution. Those personas are supplier administrators, asset managers, and the overall catalog administrator. As a supplier administrator, you can create a new service and add context to that service via templates assigned to service types. If we open an existing service, we can get a better view of that context. The templates allow you to provide information like a service description and imagery, or provide attachments or even links that would provide the information necessary for an end user to make an informed decision. Additionally, you can provide pricing information for tracking and reporting capabilities, along with adding the connector that provides the integration between service broker and the service itself. Once complete, you can preview the service to get an idea of what it will look like to the end user, and then save and submit it for approval and publishing. As a catalog administrator, you have access to all submitted services and can review, modify, and enhance them depending on business needs. For any given service, there is a set of options associated to that service that are controlled by the catalog administrator. The catalog profile allows you to view the service as it was submitted by the supplier and determine whether any changes are necessary. SLA allows you to add a service level agreement as well as any trackable metrics that might be necessary for that SLA, such as provisioning time or service availability. If you remember, as a supplier, we added pricing information to the service. As a catalog administrator, we can adjust pricing to create a cost model that reflects anything from negotiated price reductions to operations costs for a more detailed financial picture. Finally, you have workflow and questions. These options allow you to enhance the service by gathering user input, providing for approvals, activities, or other user tasks. Once complete, the catalog administrator can approve and publish the service. This makes the service available to the end user, as well as to the service broker asset manager, who can create entitlements tied to users and services. Now, from an end user perspective, Using the MyIT Universal Console or one of the mobile apps, you can easily access and request services that are available to you. Thanks for viewing, and don't forget to take a look at our other service broker demonstrations.